Everyone, my name is Python GB, and welcome back to the 20th episode of my Terraria 1.3 Let's Play. As you can see, we are currently in the Underground Hallow, and what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be starting off the episode by farming not only 15 uh, souls of light, but also 15 souls of night, because I want to go ahead and defeat a Hallowed Mimic and also a Crimson Mimic to see if I can get any cool weapons. And then after that, my friends. We're going to be doing the pirate invasion with said weapons that we managed to get. Hopefully they're weapons anyway. So, yeah, it should be pretty damn cool. As you can see, I'm going ahead. I'm grabbing a whole bunch of stuff as I go along, sort of killing many, many birds with one stone. Mostly grabbing these crystal shards because, you know, these things are pretty damn good. Here we go. And you will have to forgive me. I feel like I've got a bit of a, a cold coming on, which is not very good because, you know, YouTuber... You kind of need to not have a cold, don't you? <laughs> oh, dear. There seems to be plenty of chests around, which I guess is kind of cool. Uh, right, what's going on here? Uh, Band of regen, dynamite. Uh, uh, the rest of it can stay pretty much. Don't really need a great deal of anything else. Oh, a magic quiver. Yo. 20 Oh, increases damage by 10% and greatly increases arrow speed. Also, 20% chance not to consume arrows. Whoa. So if we go for a bow approach, we are going to be pretty good to go. Especially with our ammo box as well, dude. Wait, did we? We've got an ammo box in this series, haven't we? Pretty sure we do. Oh, God, I've got many, many rods. I can't even remember what I've got on most of them. God diggity damn it. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, things are going well, my friends. Things are going well indeed. So, I'm going to go ahead and continue farming out these, uh, these souls. And I'll meet you guys back at base once we're ready to start taking down these mimics. Oh, hey there, buddy. Hey then, bro. What you got for me? Crystal ball. Uh, we're not exactly going to be using magic weapons, so I don't think any of this stuff is really uh, useful. Eh. Oh, well, kind of cool. Do, 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 do. What? He sent out fireballs? That's his weapon? Wow, that's, that's pretty badass. <laughs> Good job to you, buddy. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, well, there we go, guys. We've got the uh, got little wizard, so that's kind of cool. But yeah, let's carry on. Yeah! Get wrecked, nymph! A metal detector displays the most valuable ore around you. Hmm, interesting. Let's go ahead and favorite that. Oh, look at that! Shows that there's platinum nearby. Interesting. Bunny? Why is there a bunny down here? What the hell, man? This is not a safe place for you, brother. What the heck? Oh, I'll leave him be. <laughs> I'm no bunny murderer. Well, for the most part, I'm not. I try my best to not be, anyway. Yeah. All right. There we go. How much have we got now? 13? Alright, two more. Oh, whoops. That was uh, pure instinct. Oh, look, mud bunnies. Oh, do you know what I think it is? I think it's because the wizard is around here. You know, you tend to associate bunnies with wizards, right? You know, bunny popping out of a hat or some crap like that. You know what I mean? I don't know. I, I feel like that would be the most logical thing. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, guys. Let's keep going. Oh, God damn it, Terraria. He's been throwing blood moons at me again. Ugh. Hi! Oh, God damn it. I really didn't want a blood moon today, brother. Good lord. Pretty sure it's just giving me millions of blood moons in a row now. This game is purposely trolling me. Oh! Careful, buddy. Don't we need to die now. Really, it has to be a blood moon plus a blooming full moon. So there's blooming werewolves everywhere, and everybody's probably gonna get killed, basically. Ah, good stuff. <laughs> oh, dear. All right, guys. We need to go ahead and find ourselves the underground crimson biome. This might be a bit difficult, actually. All right. Oh, and we need to try and farm out a whole bunch of souls of night now. So this is certainly going to be interesting, to say the least. So, yeah. Let's go and find the underground crimson. Nice. Mechanical worms. Yeah. This is good. Okay, we've got to keep this thing going, man. Come on. <laughs> uh, I need to get into the proper underground crimson, you know, the, the part that generates upon hard mode. So I think I need to go into the nearby snow biome because I look down here and I can see sort of red snow. So that, of course, means the crimson is down there. So, yeah, we need to go ahead and explore and farm. So let's do that. What the heck? 
Okay, well, I can't say I saw that. Ah, well then. There we go. <laughs> oh, man. All right. <laughs> that was a bit dumb. All right, let's keep going, though. Ooh. Come on, banana wangs, banana wangs. Ah, oh, no banana wangs. Ah, oh, dang, guy. Ooh, blizzard in a bottle. Nice. Platinum bars, archery potions. In fact, all of this stuff is pretty damn cool. <laughs> I like all of this. Oh, God. Oh, I've got to be careful of the turtles. They do a lot of damage. There we go. Easy money. All right, let's keep going. Ha, <laughs> snowball cannon. How cute. <laughs> oh, dear, this game. This game is so trolly. Hey, uh, you try and get on with me, sunshine. This is my land. Get out of here. What the hell is this? A boy out bookcase? Dude, that thing looks freaking awesome. Hey, girl, come on, man. I'm trying to do things right here. All right, you get out. Oh, where was that bookcase? That looks like a seriously cool bookcase. I'm a big fan of that. All right, let's keep going, my friends. Nice. Vitamins. Need them for the super accessory. Sweet. Big fan of that. Thank you, Terraria. Being nice to me today, man. Which is worrying, actually. Yeah. Ooh, an ammo rock. I was just sat, sat there. 59 damage? Blimey. Damn, that's a lot. Does it infinitely spin, though? That is the question. If it infinitely spins, then this might actually be a viable weapon. Tell you what, it sure goes for a while, doesn't it? I think it... Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Well, it's still pretty cool. That's 59 damage. It's a damn lot. Good lord. All right. Oh, hi. I didn't realize all you guys were here. Well, this should almost certainly bring me up to 15 souls now. There we go. There's a 15th right there. All right. Now, is there a... Yes! Yes, 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 yes! Oh, wait. No. No, no, no. No, no. That's not right. No. I need... What is it I need? Oh, come on, Python. Think, 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 think. What is it I need? I need the ice skates. That's what I need. That's it. That's the one. Right. I'll put you in there. There we go. All right. Well, we've completed our objective anyway. We've got 15 souls of each type. The uh, souls of light and souls of night. So we're good to go back to the surface, organize our inventory, and then battle a couple of mimics. So yeah, back in a mo. Alrighty guys, here we are back in action, got a bunch of uh, potions going and basically all you need to do with the souls is you need 15 of each and you just go over to a workbench and boom, key of light, key of night. You need to make one of each and then all you need to simply do is go over to an area. Oh, that's right, I, I blocked that off, didn't I? <laughs> well, apparently I'm a dum-dum. That's great. Uh, where's that flattest piece of land? It is pretty much just right next to us, isn't it? Let's be honest. Okay, so here we go. All you need to do is place down a chest, open it, put something in there, and then as soon as you let go, as long as that's the only thing in the chest, it will transform itself into a mimic. So, three, two, one, boom! And buff! Do, 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 do. Hey, buddy! Hey! Right, let's see if we can use the uh, ammo rock. Yeah, it doesn't go as far as I want it to, but actually, it does a fair amount of damage. I'm a fan of it, actually. It's kind of cool. Hi! It also does uh, frost damage to him. Ooh. Ah, okay, this battle might be a bit short-lived, actually. I like how there's not even any epic battle music when you're battling the Crimson Mimic. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, buddy! Hi! Oh, God, he's going berserk, isn't he? Ah, he seems to do two damage per tick to him. That's kind of cool. Ah, I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. Fetid back Uh, No, Tendon Huck. Is this any, is this even good? I don't even know, man. All right, let's have a look. look. So from here, the jaw hook can go to this little flower here. Okay, cool. Let's see how far the tendon hook goes. I'll actually go slightly further. The tendon hook might actually win this one. All right, how many times does it shoot out? Three, three. Okay, all right, in which case the jaw hook is now deemed useless. Cool, okay, and now we have the key of light. The Hallowed Mimic, which I don't think I've actually ever taken down before. This should be a pretty interesting little battle right here. 3,500 health. This guy's got more health than the Eye of Cthulhu does. So that's kind of cool. <laughs> ah, look at you. 106 crit damage from a little wee yo-yo. Pretty sure this is the first time I've actually used a yo-yo in a proper sort of battle situation. So this is certainly interesting. 
the Eye of Cthulhu yo-yo. I don't know if you guys have had that. You get it from the solo eclipse, and it is just unimaginably powerful. It is absolutely brilliant. All right. Come on. There we go. Uh, what's that? Whoa. What the hell is that? A Daedalus Stormbow? What the heck? Reminds me of the blizzard staff, but it just rains down with arrows instead. Dude, that's amazing! <laughs> oh man, I think that's going to be pretty useful against the event we're going to be taking down today, which of course is the pirate invasion. So let's go into our boss summoning stuff chest. Let's grab the pirate map. Let's go ahead and favor that. I kind of want to save the jester's arrows for the uh, for the what's 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 his name the dis the destroyer because I think that'd be a very very good idea and look at that just it's 61 damage man that is freaking awesome that really is right uh, oh we don't have an ammo box or do we pretty sure we don't hmm oh there is one there's one in there okay I think we should grab it out and then uh, pull it on the surface all right here we go and uh, let's grab that little ammo box right there let's go ahead and get out of here and let's go over here, put it down, and let's summon the pirate invasion. Here we go. Pirates incoming. Oh man, the 20th episode, I thought, you know, as a way of saying thanks, we'd uh, do a bunch of battling. And that's exactly what we're doing, my friends. This should be, uh, this should be interesting, to say the least. Whoa. Oh man, that is awesome. <laughs> right, I feel like I should get this quiver on me as well. Hmm, what's a replace though? That does nine defense within itself. Maybe if I put the Ranger Emblem on. 69 damage. Oh, it has to be that number, doesn't it? Okay. Uh, ooh. Hmm. Maybe this? Oh, you don't get much with it, do you? Oh, that's right. I need that. No, I need that. Okay. In which case... Maybe I can get away with... Yeah, I might be able to get away with using just this. Eh, I don't see why not. Alrighty, guys. Let's skip ahead until the pirate invasion comes, shall we? Alrighty, the pirates have arrived! Uh, where are you bunch of buggers? Ah, here they come! Oh man! Alright, rain devastation down upon everybody! Come on, do it, do it, do it! There we go, there we go, look at it! Brilliant! I'm trying to figure out what does the most damage per second at this point. I have no idea. Oh, they're spawning inside the house, man! That's, that's wrong. That is just wrong, dude. Hmm. I feel like I should be uh, blocking off this as well, actually. That would be a good idea, right? Oh, dear. All right. If we can go deathless, that would be amazing. Dude, this thing is awesome. It does so much damage. <laughs> uh, well, apart from when it misses, of course. That kind of sucks when it does miss. But, oh, man, look at this. Wait. Oh, the imp is setting them on fire. And then I'm also doing frost damage to them. So they're getting two loads of damage on them. <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, buddy! Hey! Hey, you're dead. Okay, cool. Hmm. I'm pretty sure at one point a gigantic floating pirate ship comes along. So, yeah. We do need to be very much aware of that, because that thing does a devastating amount of damage. So, yeah. Right. Uh, we do have some wood. I should be able to block this off if I'm quick. So, oh, well, he's dead. He's left. Uh, well, at least he didn't die. That would be horrible. Here we go. Do, 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 do. Raining down hell upon the earth because it's kind of fun to do that. <laughs> oh, come on, peeps. I mean, to be honest, there's no point in blocking this off anymore, right? Because there's no one in here, so yeah. Well, where's the dudes at? Oh. That's that's a lot of dudes. That's the, that's a lot of dudes. So that's where they all are. Yeah, that might be problematic. I need to get down there and kill them all. Come on. Kill all the peeps. Kill all the peeps. All the peeps must die. Pirate Corsair, yep, all of you. I'm sorry, you all have to die. It's the way of the world. Oh, they keep coming down. Hmm, this is a bit of a problem. We may have to get a different place to kill them. Oh, come on. Oh, man, we've got to get out of it. All right, boom. Hmm, this really is problematic, actually. Maybe we should go on top of here. We're going to fight on top of the house, because why not? Come on. Oh, little parrots. Think they can take me down. Little squawky squawks. Dang, guys. Right, yeah. We're going to get away from the fisherman's house and we're going to go fight somewhere else because this is not really a very good place. Let's be honest right here. Okay. Man, 
I wish I had the fetid bag knacks. Those things, for those of you guys who don't know, are just absolutely insane. They would be absolutely brilliant against the pirate invasion. They do a stupid amount of damage per second. They really do. They are considered the fastest melee weapon in the uh, in the entire game, actually. According to the wiki, anyway. So, I'm not sure. I haven't played enough of 1.3 to really comment, so... Yes. Right, I'll tell you what. While we're, while we're doing this, we can actually jump into the uh, question of the video. And for today, that comes from a user by the name of Zippo. Just Zippo. Nice and nice and short name. I like that. <laughs> and this question is, which NPC is your favorite in Terraria? Uh, for me, that would have to be the Goblin Tinkerer. That's pretty much my only answer to that. Because, let's be honest, the Goblin Tinkerer probably does the most useful functional things in that he uh, gives you the ability to reforge, he sells the rocket boots, he sells the goblin tinkerer table, you know, all of them things are very, very useful, so, yeah. Oh, man. Still no sign of any sort of advanced dude yet, which is kind of annoying. We're about a third of the way through the invasion, and there's just nothing. No captains, no nothing, dude. But, um, maybe there's one down there. I don't know. Like I said, I want to try and keep away from this, uh, in this here place. Oh, this thing's fully auto as well. Ah, this is kind of cool. Man, I didn't realize this thing was fully auto, but it is. And it's kind of cool. <laughs> Look at these guys. Trying to avoid their deaths. Lol. Still no sign of any uh, rare mob drops just yet. Just got a bunch of things, basically. Bunch of uh, furniture. That's the word I'm looking for. There we go. Uh, everybody's just getting killed on the inside by the NPCs. The NPCs are actually doing a decent job in uh, in defending themselves, apparently. So that's okay. I'm okay with that. Hi! Oh, there's a captain. Oh, this guy might actually kill me. As long as I keep doing damage to him, he won't do damage to me, right? All right, he's at half health. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. 600, 400, 300, 2, 1, and dead. There we go. Captain Dam, that's actually reasonably easy. <gasps> whoa, 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 what? 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 Oh my god! I am speechless. In the 20 years that I have lived, I have never been speechless. That is the coin gun, ladies and gentlemen. I'm pretty sure it's one of the... Ooh! Big pirate ship. Need to kill him, need to kill him, need to kill him. This is where this thing comes in useful. Here we go. The good thing about this thing is I'm pretty sure it has a chance of spawning... No, not spawning something. It has a chance of dropping something cool, though. I can't remember what it is exactly. Come on. Just need to be careful. Okay, come on, man. I can't believe we got the coin gun, man. Isn't that thing like a 1 in 8,000 drop? It's considered one of the rarest things in the game to get. But we've managed to blooming get it! The first time I've ever got it. Like, for real. Oh, oh there's me dead. Rip. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, I do hope I don't get spawn killed. That would be very embarrassing. Alright, uh, we're 60% of the way through the invasion. The only good mob drop we've actually got so far. And it happens to be the coin gun. That is just the most stupidest thing in the entire world. Alright, uh, let's just rain down devastation from the skies to these guys, because why not? That is what you do in a situation like this. Come on, man. If we just keep raining down devastation, we're going to be good to go, man. Come on, Captain. You're almost dead now. And he is out of the game. Alright, sweet, sweet, sweet. Alright, I think we should uh, switch to this thing. Get rid of all these guys here. Okay... Oh, I am. Oh, I can't believe we got the blooming coin gun, dude. That is unbelievably lucky. Terraria is being nice, and I am very scared. Ow. Okay, need to be careful still. Oh. Oh, that's why I don't have the blooming thing. No, we're gonna, probably going to get killed again, actually. Yep, there we go. <laughs> oh, man. All right, does that guy stay around? Uh, no, he appears to be flying off. God damn it. Okay. Oh, I'm so hyped for that, man. I'm so hyped. So hyped for that coin gun, dude. Can't believe it. Oh, he's come back. 
Oh, he's still got the same amount of health as he had before as well. Cool. All right, man. Come on, keep it going, dude. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. There was a captain on the other side, but I kind of want to take this thing down because I've only taken down one so far. And I feel like he might drop something cool. Where is he going? I can't say I'm entirely sure of uh, where he's going, but oh well. Well, rain down deaths and destruction. Because that's what it keeps doing to me, basically. There we go. Anything cool from that? I don't think I've got anything, actually. All right. Do -do 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 -do. Killing everybody, because that's what I like to do. Hmm. Sailor shirt? Okay, pretty cool. Uh, I'll tell you what, a cutlass wouldn't be, uh, wouldn't go amiss, to be honest. I th I, I kind of like that, actually. So, Tabaria, you know, if you could perhaps do that, that would be awesome. Oh, well, one of my NPCs just got slain. Oh, dear. All right, I think we need to get in here and kill this guy. All right, there we go. Hi! Huh, everybody else seems to be okay, actually. do 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 <laughs> I don't care that I've died, man. I, I'm so hyped. I can't. I just can't believe it. Oh god! Time to rain down death and destruction again. Do 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 do. Come on, man. <laughs> oh, we are nearly done with this thing at this point, my friends, which is awesome because it means we can move on to something else. Uh, I still really want to try and get the fetid bag next, though. Because I might actually be able to take down the destroyer with that thing. And is everybody almost. But there we go. That's that guy done. Oh, I am almost dead. Oh look, there's another one! <laughs> oh man, there's a lot of pirate ships floating around. Good lord. Okay, why not, dude? All right, come on, man. Come back. Come back to me. Let's have a bit of this. There we go. And let's get back over here. I'm hoping that guy's still there anyway. The pirates have been defeated. Huh, interesting. I don't even remember killing any of them. Uh, pirate deckhand. Come on, man. Is that everybody? I think that's everybody. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was the pirate invasion. Not too bad. Not too bad. I'm liking the addition of the actual pirate ship. I think that's really, really cool. So, yeah, and of course, I really appreciate the fact that there is, uh, you know, the progress bar as well. And more to the point, we got a freaking coin gun, dude. This is... Ugh, look at it, man. i got to try and reforge this thing, dude. I want to see if I can get Unreal. If we get Unreal on it first time, I, I don't even know. I don't even know, dude. Just, just, I don't even know. Sluggish. Lazy. Zealous, slow, agile, lethargic, rapid. Slow, hasty. I take it you can't get plus damage on it. Is, is, that, is that the case? I don't know, man. Maybe one more. Ah, lethargic and quick. Eh, okay. I don't think you can get damage modifiers on it. I don't know. Or maybe I was just being deeply unlucky. But whatever the case, my friends. That was, uh, that was pretty cool, man. That was pretty damn cool. I am... A big fan of all of that. Let's go put all the golden furniture inside of here because why the heck not? And yeah, I think on that note, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to end the episode. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy the episode and of course you're excited to see more, be sure to drop a like right, my friends. Be much appreciated. And of course, you can subscribe if you want to know in the future videos. All right, thank you very much for, once again for your continued support. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode.